Hi Scorpio, happy October. I hope you are doing well. Okay, again guys, the way I'm setting these up, watch your polarity point, the house looking back at you. Okay, it'll most likely have the other half of the equation. All right. I'm curious to see how this is going to be because Taurus just got a, an amazing reading, but it's going to have upheaval first. Okay. So let's see. A strategy. Okay. So you need a game plan here, which you're very good at. Okay. For some of you, I think you're you're going to publish something or write something or do something here that brings in in substantial amount of money. Okay. And I don't think it's exactly what you think it is. Think bigger here, okay? This I believe Libra got this too. So it's again, I need a strategy, but I need to get my butt off the fence, okay? Things are coming your way that I don't think you can see you may have your trajectory going this way, but this is just saying, wait, we have other doors for you here. We have other options. There are other ways to do this, right? We need a different plan, maybe. We need a plan, right? Let's see. New beginnings, brand new beginnings. Embrace these. It's time for a change. Take a chance on yourself, okay? Again, very much like what I said. The Magician card is about uh, will, desire, and then focus and manifest your dreams, okay? You've got to get the strategy, right? And then you've got to be open to things. This is being open. At the Fool card... You don't know what's ahead of you, but you know you're going to take the chance here. You're going to not only take the chance, you're going to make it happen. The magician will, it, with this card, it's like use your powers for good, right? And you're going to, right? Okay. Holy cow. Okay. I like that. Okay, Queen of Cups. Trust yourself, trust your intuition, okay? You've got this. You've got this. Three of Cups, celebration, happiness, heaven on earth. You're anchored in this. It's coming for you. Embrace this change here, okay? Nurture yourself. Take care of yourself. Listen to your heart here. Let your heart guide you here. Okay. Page of Swords. Trust yourself. This is all about trusting yourself. Be who you are. Truly show up as who you are. This is about clarity, too. That page of swords, you get clarity there. It's in your past, so you're getting clear about something. Okay? If you're not clear in October, you will be by the end of the year. All right? Okay. Five of swords. Okay? You're going to need to probably confront something, okay? For some of you, you may feel defeated here. This is just saying, I'm gonna, I need to keep my cool here, okay? And I need to not lose my temper and I need to get my thoughts clear. I need to get my plan in place here. This is all about proper planning, okay? Be honest about something here. 
if this is something in your periphery where you're like you're having some kind of issue with someone, say your partner or whatever, be honest with them and be honest with yourself about whatever this is here, okay? With the Five of Swords, though, I'll say it's in the delivery, so don't, um, you don't want to pull in any, uh, you, it, you want to say something, but you don't want to go for someone's juggler, okay? For some of you, If you're doing this, I'm going to advise you don't do it. If, if Again, and in Taurus's reading too, it was about, I really feel it, and I feel it in here too. If you are, you don't want to be the one who's got victory through deceit here. You know what I'm saying? So you, you want to do things, you truly want to do things on the up and up now. Even if you think, if I don't say this, it won't go in my favor. Fight the urge to do that. I'll clarify because with the magician it can be it can go one of two ways so you may have someone against someone that you're coming up against you're crowned with the queen of cups you're anchored in the three of cups this will not do things above board here this can be someone coming up against you that's just not a good person okay You need a strategy, remember. You need a strategy. There's other ways to do this with the uh, Ace of Cups. Happiness, contentment. Okay, your heart will sing again. Open your heart to something here, okay? Again, if you've just gotten slammed by something, you're thinking, lady, I am locking it right now with a padlock. Don't do that. Keep your heart open. Be who you are. Be the loving, caring, giving, nurturing person that you are. Okay? Take care of yourself here. Trust your intuition. This is huge. Okay? For some of you, you've got a new relationship coming in here. For some of you, it's kind of like your life force has come back. Full force. Emperor, I think that Taurus got this in the same spot. I can't say verbatim, but I think they did. This is about taking control of um, your life, ruling your kingdom. Um, it's about showing up, taking control of a situation here. Okay. You see how the it's just. It's just about getting your ducks in a row, okay? Empress, natural order of things. You've got the emperor and the empress. Your energies will be balanced here, okay? This is I know when to hold them, I know when to fold them. This is a bursting out and a locking down, okay? You've got it. Bursting out, locking down. It's the natural order of things. Six of Swords, you're moving on to something here. Okay, so you are leaving a situation here and you're going on to something else. This is the card of movement too. You may be buying something somewhere else. You may be moving. Either way, there's movement with, with this. Okay. It's a card, too, that just if you're on the fence about something, the answer in here is, is move on, especially with that in your outbound. It's just run its course with the emperor and the empress. And you've got the seven of swords just popped out. Okay. This is a card of, um, how do I say? There could be deceit in here. There could be deceit on someone else's part, or you're deceiving yourself, or you're selling yourself a bad bill of goods. But this card... At a, at a metaphysical meaning, at a, at a occult meaning here, is I am not, I realize that 
just because things look like this, my life is not written in stone. I can change things here. And that's why we do tarot. If you don't like what you see, you can. We're not faded one thing. We're just not. And this card is saying, I'm not going to settle for this just because this is what I'm told I can have. You can have more than that. With that seven of swords, you're done though. Like you're going to go about it. You're not going to take what the life has given you. You're going to rise above that. And that's what that card really means. Okay. In here. But for some of you, you've got, you're going to see things in people that you've not seen before. And I think there are established relationships that you've got, like friendships, families, or whatever. And I think that you're going to be shocked at just who these people truly are, right? And you're going to see them for what they are, and you move on from this. It's time that this card says, look, go. Just, just go. It's time to leave. Okay? So there you go. I hope that I helped you in some way. Again, watch your polarity house. This is a good reading, but I think you've got... You're leaving stuff and you're you're pulling in a whole new life here. You've got massive cards here. These are there's with this with people in here. These are these are established relationships, people that you work with, people in your family, friends, you know, neighbors. But this is just saying that you're gonna go in a different direction here and you're gonna organize it and get get going here. And this is just saying that you know you're going to get the plan and you're going to lock it down. Okay. And the outbound card is you need to go. Okay. So there you go. I hope that I helped you in some way. If you need a private reading, please reach out to me. Okay. Happy October. Again, this will play out. I don't feel it's going to, I think it may show itself in October, but these readings that I'm doing, I'm, I'm setting the intention for, for now to the end of the year. Okay. So there you go.